Since its opening in 1914, the Panama Canal has been a green route, helping in the reduction of time and distances for the maritime world. More than a million ships have benefited from the Panama Canal route by reducing costs and changing world trade patterns. By using this route, these ships not only reduce navigation time, but also the emissions of carbon dioxide, CO2, to the atmosphere. With the Panama Canal expansion, the strategic global trade advantages, as well as the benefits for the environment, will multiply. The Panama Canal not only generates savings in time and costs to its users, it is the best option to preserve the environment, preventing further CO2 emissions which are causing global warming. During the past 100 years, the Panama Canal Green Route has provided a reduction of approximately 650 million tons of CO2. With the expanded canal, it is estimated that the Panama Canal Green Route will reduce more than 160 million tons of CO2 in the first 10 years of operation. The Panama Canal has launched the Green Connection Environmental Recognition Program to ships and customers with high environmental performance who use the waterway. The Green Connection Award uses as a reference the Environmental Ship Index SEI, fuel efficiency, and the reduced emissions by using the Panama Canal route. The Panama Canal has a CO2 emission module for the maritime industry, which allows to calculate and indicate CO2 emissions for world trade routes. These emissions calculations will help in selecting the routes not only on the basis of variable costs, but also taking into account environmental factors which will place the Panama Canal as a predominant route. With the expansion, the Panama Canal route will contribute to the possibility of transporting larger cargo volumes using fewer ships. Additionally, there is a reduction of CO2 emissions by incurring less cargo movements compared to other cargo transportation systems such as planes, trucks or rail. Furthermore, the Panama Canal is also focused on its watershed protection and management in order to preserve water resources and strengthen environmental and social programs with neighboring populations. These programs include reforestation efforts with millions of trees planted in the watershed and in other parts of the country. These efforts are part of the Canal Expansion Environmental Mitigation Program under the Alliance for a Million Hectares. Currently, the Panama Canal is carrying out an Environmental Economic Incentives Program, working with communities to develop sustainable production. These programs are projected to absorb 1 million tons of CO2. In this way, with the expansion, the Panama Canal Green Route will contribute to the efforts of countries, the industry, the United Nations Framework Convention on Climate Change, and the International Maritime Organization to help in the reduction of greenhouse gas emissions.